Raven, but then sometimes Zero Suit will kill Mewtwo. Five. And that's it. And you're done. That's the whole matchup. That's just how this goes. And uh, if anything, then I can say probably both strengths. One, Mewtwo can get paralyzed pretty easily because he's such a big body target and can get distracted pretty easily by a charging Shadow Ball. Then again, Shadow Ball can break through Paralyzer as well. So right. it's kind of a double-edged sword in that. Not double-edged sword, but they both do something. Yeah, I feel like there's a lot of counterplay to each other in the match, which is cool. Like, it doesn't feel like there's certain advantages, but they can just counterplay each other pretty well. Yeah, and going for the down throw set for the mix, uh... <laughs> I... Uh, I mean, I'm impressed with what he tried to go with, but right, it didn't yeah. happen. Yeah, I always think Disable is pretty cool. What's the down here? I just <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Disable is one of the coolest moves in this entire game. I'm, oh, yeah. I'm willing to say that. He keeps on trying to go for it. He keeps on trying to style on this man. Why not? <laughs> Why not? For the reads. Oh, but instead, going for the forward air and just forcing them off the platform. And instead, that's a death I can't right there. That kills. God. I mean, once again, they both have some really dumb options. I'm guessing <laughs> you were talking about kill that five with maybe like down B or something. Down B, some. Well, if you have like rage, it depends on the stage, obviously. Like here. Oh, oh, behind him. Okay. That move has a lot of. And then no one will ever let you forget about how stupid Mewtwo's uh Mewtwo's moves are. Like his up tilt is dumb, his down tilt <laughs> is dumb, his shadow ball is dumb, but most importantly, uh what I was gonna say that I completely forgot, his forward air is probably the yeah, dumbest when, move in his get. When you when you're at kill percent against Mewtwo, you have two game plans. Shield, but then he grabs you and kills you, or jump, and then he forward airs you. So you gotta you gotta kinda guess. <laughs> and then the tertiary options with grabs. The grabs being dumb. Oh, okay. Oh, he didn't want to roll into that, and instead, gonna get heavily punished. And instead, this could be a nice, really, this could be a really nice edge guard situation. But oh, oh, that was good. But in the opposite direction, Turek taking a 360. We're wondering if he gets back on stage and instead forced a uh, edge guard situation on Frosty. Instead, didn't go for a ledge trump. Just tried to wait there and see what he could do. And it, it seems it, like yeah, it can be good to see that ledge trump anyway. Yeah, you might it's as not, well. Yeah, if you got the timing to. down, you might as well just do it most of the time. And, ooh, I could tell that Frosty was just looking for an up scenario. Oh, yeah. But there was nothing coming out right there. Yeah, we was not trying to force oh. Ooh, but instead, catching with a nice girl, jump. And that makes sense, because up smash kind of covered everything except for roll. Yeah, I was surprised he actually went for uh, a Zare there. That was kind of weird up That was pretty good. <laughs> all he had to do was wait. Exactly. It covered basically all the options. That was, that was pretty good. Something that Frosty does a lot is Frosty kind of, you can tell on, uh, on his face, Lost in thought a little bit. Yeah, I mean that seems to be as good as you know. <laughs> I mean, you always want to be thinking about what's going on in your matchup, anyways. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I don't. I don't know if you switch characters, but it definitely was not the best. Thing. <laughs> but in any case, we see ZSS versus Mewtwo once again. Two uh, two white-ish characters, more cream, right. more uh, pale. I don't even know zombie, something yeah. like that. You two, yeah, it's, it's zombie. <laughs> yeah, sure. We're talking about white characters. We're talking about game watch. That's straight white. That's just a solid white. It's Gimmer right there, man. Yeah, it's straight Gimmer. If, if you air dodge, it doesn't look like anything. You, oh, and if you're playing on Final Destination, you just bang into the background. Yeah? <laughs> this man's a solid white Mountain Dew. Yeah, so basically, we'll have a lot of the advantages, but if you just trust the chance to do things, it shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, but then again, if you're Mewtwo, down tilt kind of crosses up a lot of what ZSS can do. ZSS, even though I think ZSS is cool, Jab is kind of our best neutral choice because down tilt kind of laggy, kind of sucks. Right. No, I think uh, ZSS grounds will not that good. Because even if she does have pretty good tools, but a lot of them just don't do that much. Like, even Jab, it only does 6%, barely sends them anywhere, it doesn't do much. But it's still, I mean, it's fast, it, it works a lot of the time. It's just like, you know, you're not getting that much off of it. Whereas if you're trying, if you're punishing in the air zero suit, you can get a huge damage, you can kill, you know, it's, it's a lot different. So if there's if you're stuck on the ground with zero suit, then... But if there's anything I'd consider a slight advantage for ZSS, is she can jab lock with a forward tilt, sometimes. Ooh, right. yeah, that, yeah, that's interesting. <laughs> and a jab lock against Mewtwo can do a ton of damage, because forward smash is stupid good when you can land it. Oh, yeah. And it works, for that matter. Yeah, it actually connects when it needs to. Right. I mean, sure, you, you can get out of it the first hit, but at the same time, you're not really going to be using it in neutral anyways, unless you're weird. <laughs> unless you're weird, that is correct. Yeah, unless you're me. <laughs> but instead, oh. the up tilt coming out, that seems to be something I've noticed that a lot of ZSSs have been doing as of recent. And at least in this year alone, a lot more ZSSs have been going for up tilt because it's really nice anti-air just on the ground. Yeah, it's pretty good, dude. Like, if you know what moves to punish, it, it's really good. Really Speaking fun. of knowing what to punish, one more ever just completely <laughs> read the roll and oh, instead yeah. bopped him up. Bip. So far, it doesn't get too crazy with 
time to go for the kill. He's, he's doing alright. He doesn't have to force anything. Obviously, see, Mewtwo reacts to damage so fast, so you shouldn't let him get too ahead, but at the same time, you know, you're only making it worse when you're trying to force things. And instead, the up tilt coming out and killing. Okay. Uh, you know, I can't say I'm surprised, but, <laughs> but being a, it's just so strong. Being a lighter character, being a bigger body just doesn't do you too well. Okay. See, like I said, forward tilt. Forward tilt actually has a lot more going for than I thought. It has decent right. range, does enough damage, has decent knockback, and can reset you. Out of all the forward tilts, it's probably the most exemplary example. It's probably the best example of uh, just decent. Uh, decent, like, yeah, just a quick. Uh, it it does what it needs to, basically. Right. It's not the greatest thing ever, but it does it. Can. Ooh, that might have been a pretty nice opportunity to go for a paralyzer, but it seems like uh, Frosty just opted to run away, make more space, and that's kind of smart. Yeah, but at the same time, it space. It depends how much you respect your opponent, because he probably thought maybe we're we'll just going to break out really fast, which not every time you should do that, but at the same time, just ready for the next option. It's kind of a, uh, it's kind of weird what happens when you try to get away from it because if you get away from it, you're either gonna be making space for Shadow Ball or you're gonna be making space for Mewtwo to try to chase you. And Mewtwo is not really the biggest fan of chasing. Right. If anything, he's gonna want to try to land on top of you in the air. <laughs> but instead, it seems like ZSS is doing a lot of the chasing right now, just trying to fish for the aerials because he might as well do some nice combo damage or at least just a nice straight hit would do a lot of nice things right. for him. But instead, the forward air being able to come out and just. Yeah. Slide him away. Yeah, Werewolf's mixing up pretty well, like, as far as in the air, because uh, Frosty's 